I'm glad you came back. Well, I needed to get my parking validated. So your items were never recovered? No. Earlier you said that the items weren't that important. Yet now you seem very upset that they're gone. Well, I'm a walking paradox. What can I say? Sometimes we need to lose something before we can understand its value. I didn't lose anything. No. No, you were the victim of a crime. It's only natural that you would feel violated. And often our feelings of loss connect to how we feel about who we are. Oh, right, so we're back on that, are we? You want to talk about my identity? Well, yes, because you're the devil. You told me your names, but you left out a few others. Abaddon, Balliol, Prince of Darkness. Someone's been brushing up on their Sunday school. Yes, but before you fell, you were known as Samael, the Lightbringer. I don't go by that name anymore. That was a name that connotated your father's love for you. <laughs> right. Was casting his son into hell also an expression of his love? No, God didn't cast you out of heaven because he was angry with you. How can you presume to know God's intentions? No, I don't. I can't. Then maybe stick within the limits of your intellectual capacity. Or maybe my simplicity offers me a different perspective. God cast you out because he needed you to do the most difficult of jobs. It was a gift. Gift? He shunned me. He vilified me. He made me a torturer. Can you even begin to fathom what it was like? Eons spent providing a place for dead mortals to punish themselves. I mean, why do they blame me for all their little failings, as if I'd spent my days sitting on their shoulder, forcing them to commit acts they'd otherwise find repulsive? Oh, the devil made me do it! I have never made any one of them do anything! Never! What happened to you is unfair. Unfair? This is unjust. For all eternity, my name will be invoked to represent all their depravity. That is the gift that my father gave me. It was an act of love. How do you know? Because you are his favorite son, Samael. Do not call me that, please. You are his fallen angel. But here's the thing, when angels fall, they also rise. All you have to do is embrace all that you are. I can't. Yes, you can. You just have to be open to the process. You don't understand. I can't. But why? Because I stole them from me, you...